Hey guys, I'm here in Sony Condo 2023, and as a Latino creator, I thought it'd be fun to find other Latinos and ask them a few cool questions. Let's go. Okay, hi, I'm here with Maria Perez. Are you Latina? Si, soy. <laughs> she knows Spanish. <laughs> All right, so what's your like family background? Um, so I was born in the U.S., but my father is from Uruguay, mm. and my mother is from Colombia. So. Oh, you're like a mixed Latina. Uh -huh. My family's from Puerto Rico, mm. so I was born here I too, though. Puerto All right, what's your favorite kind of thing from our culture that you love? Um, well, obviously the food, <laughs> but honestly, I kind of love the way we express ourselves, yes. which I think makes a huge difference also like in the field that we're in. I feel like we are much looser. Like I'm ready to give you a hug, but I love to talk with my hands. Yeah. And you know, I love to be expressive. And I think that kind of does in a general way go through everybody who is. Who do you represent? So I represent- Here's a plug, here's a plug. <laughs> I represent B&H. We love b &H. <laughs> So I work for b &H. I work on our social media team, creative video. Yay, all right, great. <laughs> I'm here with Ira Black. ¿Cómo está, señor? Ah, estoy bien. Todo bien. Oh, bien, bien. bien. Oh, oh, nuestra amigo Latina, ah. amiga Latina, María. María. Oh. Bienvenidos, Havana, Cuba. Welcome to Havana, Cuba. U usted no. eres Latino? No, no, no. Oh, soy no, la no. Latino. Pero soy americano. Pero as uh, as en Cuba. Yes. I was made in Cuba. <laughs> My Echo. parents were on their honeymoon there. Oh. No. Echo. Me? Echo. Echo in Cuba. Eso lo que me hace falta un novio. Novio. Yo ando buscando eso un novio. I don't know what she said, but everyone's laughing. Made in Cuba. And he has a wonderful book about baseball in Cuba. Uh, yeah, and that baseball. must have been fantastic. Baseball is a religion Absolutely. in Cuba. Yeah. It's incredible. They make a ball out of a rock, paper, and tape. And, and they use, you know, for a bat, a tree limb. Ciao. Hasta luego. <laughs> Okay, I think this guy's. I ran up the stairs to get you, man. <laughs> I know we're both out of breath. We're yeah, at altitude. I know it's like it's, it's eleven thousand feet. Ugh, All right, so uh, hey, we kind of look similar. Yeah, it's, I mean. it's the bald head. I'm a little lighter. You can fix that in post, though. <laughs> well, first of all, where's your family from? Yeah, so uh, my family's from Puerto Rico as well. No way, Boricua. So my dad is from Lattice, and my mom is from uh, Santa Isabel. Were you born there or here? I was born here, which is why I got this sweet accent. But uh, <laughs> my family's from Puerto Rico. So Igual. We sad. probably have a lot of the same traditions. So is yeah. there anything that, like, what do you define with as being a Latino creator? Clearly from the shape of my body. Um, <laughs> it's food. <laughs> Yeah. Pasteles, pastelillos, <laughs> arroz con gandules, peni. Dude, I gotta oh, show you something right now. It. My mom just sent me this picture. Game over. Why, why are we here <laughs> when your mom just made freaking pasteles? Like, we, we should be eating that. Yeah. So, as a creator, what, um, what is like your passion? What's the main thing you shoot and love to do? Uh, my passion is portrait photography. Yeah, 100%. I love people. I love photographing them. You're also I a love... great teacher. We Thank love you. everything Thank you provide you. back to the community. That's that's a big passion of mine as well, teaching people on, on photography, on YouTube, on content creation. Uh, but my real passion is just working with people in general. Yeah. If I could do it through taking their photo or teaching them something, oh, that's, that's what I'm all about. Bodhi Thank you, brother. Yeah. Bodhi Thank, you brother. Yeah. Thank you, brother. <laughs> all right, cool. Seriously. Yeah, that's awesome. awesome. Thank you, Miguel. Hey, I think I found another Latino creator. Uh, you're Latino, right? I think I found another one. Hola, ¿cómo estás? Todo bien, tú sabes. Estoy muy bien. Hablas Gracias. español? Sí, hablo. Hi, I'm Gabriela Gabriela. I am Colombian. I also Beautiful. have some Peruvian roots and Spaniard roots. Oh, that's great. Um, I root down in New York City. <laughs> hey, and New I'm Jersey. A photographer. Oh, very cool. So, um, what is like when you think of being a Latina, Latinx? What resonates with you? What is the first thing you think about when you think Latino or Hispanic? Wow, I think cultura. I think yeah. musica. I think comunidad. I think unity. I think. All these like bright, beautiful exactly cultures and cuisines and like in different dialects. It's and like a flavor, you know. It's like flavor. absolutely. It's a, it's a smell. It's an aroma. It's a movement. It's Do you know what pasteles are? 
You are uh, Puerto Rican? Yeah. We don't have. Bastardes. I know. Do you know what they are? I'm going to show you a picture. Okay. <laughs> Tell me what you would call this in your country. Okay. I know it looks like a turd, but... <laughs> no, it looks like a tamal. Yeah. Un tamal, exactly. Tamal. Unity, I think. Perfect. And one tradition your family just keeps it just keeps going we have a lot of traditions okay name one um you love empanadas mm. con un con un ají <laughs> i love it un ají. Con un ají. <laughs> okay let's get to the business stuff so as a creator <laughs> what is your what are you making i am a portrait photographer i'm a street photographer oh cool um i love telling stories combining forces with other creatives, other artists, musicians, bringing sound and visuals and smell and all of the things that I was talk talking about, the flavor together into one new world. I love it. That's great. Thank you so much. That You're was welcome. great. And Yay. happy Hispanic, Hispanic Heritage, Heritage Month. Month. Woo! Hey, I think I found another Latino here. Hey, how are you? Hey, hello. Juan. <laughs> this, is, this is Juan Flores. Are you Latino? I am. Yes. Cool. My uh, my dad's Mexican. Cool. My mom's white. Going around just asking people what's their favorite thing about being Latino, or what did you grow up with? What kind of cultural, you know, traditions, or what do you love about? Um, I mean, the one thing I really loved growing up was whenever I'd go over to my grandma, my abuelas, was the amount of making sure I was fed. <laughs> yeah, the food. Everybody's saying the food. food. And uh, favorite camera settings? Um, the one thing I love a lot is uh, bracketing as far as overexposure, your base ground, and your underexposure. So that way you could kind of focus in on what highlights you want to pull in, what shadows, what depths. Um, like us, look, you're in the highlights, I'm in the <laughs> Exactly, all the shadows. We would bracket us. Yes, 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 yes. The middle would be in the middle. Yeah. Thanks so much. Hey, no problem. All right, Have cool. a good one. See ya. Okay, we're here with another Latino, I think. You have to confirm that. Claro que sí. <laughs> claro, there it is, you passed the test. <laughs> Where's your family from? My family and myself are from Ecuador, so oh. I came here to New York when I was eight. Oh, that's cool. I was born here, but we still have a lot of traditions and food and stuff. So for you, what does it mean to be Latino? What are your favorite things? Uh, well, being Latino is, uh, it's funny because I think Family is a big part of your Absolutely, culture. Absolutely, yeah. And America is really not as much family oriented. Yeah. So I've always had to deal with the polarity of trying to be, you know, trying to fit into this culture, but at the same time trying to keep a, a very important nucleus. For sure, for that sure. That makes me me. And what are you working on now? Uh, what's your what are expertise and how are you mm -hmm. a creator? <laughs> uh, I've been a commercial and fine art photographer for a decade. Uh, I created a couple of techniques that I, I guess I'm known for, one of them being levitation photography Love without it, Photoshop. Man. Yeah. And now I'm working on studying the angles of photography uh, or visual narrative from a mathematical perspective. Ooh. And so, uh, you know, trying to find the truth uh, within the visual narrative, right? I came from opera and in opera you learn music theory. And music theory is all about the mathematics and the composition of what makes music music. You wow. know, whether it's minor or major or sad or happy, what makes that that? So how do we distill that? Uh, from a visual perspective wow. and try to you know, quantify that. That's incredible. This is why Kondo is so awesome. Like these ideas <laughs> that you hear that other people have. So that's fantastic, man. Thank, Thank you, you so much for Thank hanging you. out with us for a few minutes. Thank you. Thank que you bueno. All right. Vamos. Arroz y habichuelas. Yay. Que rico. Let's go. <laughs> I think I found another Latina. Here she is. Are you Latina? No. <laughs> Here's someone. Armando. ¿Cómo están? ¿Todo bien? <laughs> right. Hey, papá. Hey, papi. ¿Cómo está? <laughs> I think that's something that's very Hispanic, right? Yeah, right, right, right. <laughs> yeah, so mom is from Guadalajara, Mexico. Oh, Mexico, yeah. Uh, dad's from Michoacán. Oh, cool. And similar to you, I was born here in the States, Los Angeles. Awesome. Um, so, yeah. Great Hispanic community in yeah. LA. Oh, 100%. I mean, yeah, for sure. For me, being Latin, like I always think food and culture mm. and just You're making me hungry. <laughs> <laughs> For you, like what do you associate with being Latino? Like uh, the pride that you have. Ah, the culture, man. Yeah. I mean, it's just like, it's strong. The conchas, bro, the chocolate, <laughs> like, oh, dude, like, you know, just, just the culture, man. Like, I, I just, it's, 
It's hard to describe. La like chancla, bro. Everything is <laughs> the <laughs> culture, bro. The culture. La chancla. Yeah, um, yeah, that's even in Disney and Coco. La yeah, chancla. Yeah, right, yeah. yeah, dude, they know. They, they know. know. Yeah. <laughs> So those are the things that like we, there's like a code, you know, as right. Latinos, we know the chancla. For those of you that don't know, that's, you know, your mom or grandmother's mad, she'll throw her chancla, oh, which is her, her yeah. flip-flop. And I think that's what's great about being Latino is there's just this, we still hold on to our, even though you and I were born right. here, like, right. We still do in the holidays, we do at Benin, which yep. is the pork. Arroz con gandules is yep. something that's Puerto Rican. Yeah, man, it's like we said, like the, the cultural things that, that, even just like the small little things, like, I know, I know this maybe happened to you possibly where it's like uh, maybe uh, your parent asked you like, hey, go, go pick something, find this for me. You go there, you can't find it. And I'm like, if I find it, I'm going to be, you know, and it's like those little things yeah. that you can relate to that. For sure, a hundred percent. Oh man, We're great. just scarred, bro. That's we're, it. You're just scarred. Honestly, <laughs> we need help. <laughs> That's why we do YouTube because this totally. is our, our outlet. Therapy, you know? therapy. Yeah, therapy. So uh, what is your passion for creating? What do you like to work on the most? Uh, for me, uh, short films. Love yeah. short films. Love working with other creators, collaborating like this. I love doing this kind of stuff. By the way, yeah. uh, Latinos are a little underrepresented in the creative space. Yes. You have something that helps. So, I have a Spanish channel. Um, you can look it up. It's Armando en Español. Porque yo sé que va a haber gente que va a decir, Armando, Sony te está pagando y por eso estás hablando muy bien de su cámara. Pero mira, pinga. Awesome. And I have a channel called Omar no sabe el español tanto bueno, pero no, no, I should have a channel. But check out the channel. And I learned something new this week that in the podcast space, Spanish speaking podcasts are the fastest growing sector. Wow. But they're not getting the advertising dollars. Oh, we got to change that. Be, right? Because advertisers don't, they can't translate like what they're trying to sell into the Latin market. I haven't told you. Okay. You're Literally like two days ago. Well, it's it's been... A long time in the making, okay. but offici well, unofficially. Are we still beta. recording here? Yeah, okay. yeah, yeah. All right. Um, I started an agency to help creators, Dude. and that's what one of my mission goals is to help the Latino community. Also, you know, obviously, wow. like, yeah, 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 yeah. The people that are unrepresented. So yeah, this is something, bro. Yep. Oh, man, this is great. <laughs> this is great stuff. <laughs> Guys, I think I found someone from Peru. Are you, I'm sorry, are you from Peru? Yeah, I was born in Peru. No way. <laughs> That's how it makes. Is that offensive? I'm sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Look at Dick. Hey. ¿Cómo estamos? Tú eres latino. Claro que sí. De dónde? Venezolano. Nací en Caracas, Venezuela. Ah. All right. For we're doing Hispanic Heritage Month. Okay. So we're kind of asking everyone, like, what does it mean to be Latino or Hispanic? Like, what are some things that are the core of you know your country and what you love the core of our country i think is just i mean there's so many things for, for us it's like that spark the flame of of you know being from south america yeah the food oh, the food the everybody people, says that yeah and the warmth <laughs> of just like you know the the warmth of the people I think, that's a like, great way to go, say it yeah everyone's yeah. been saying kind of the same thing that um there's just you you feel welcome and it's you know they'll sit you down it's food uh for us i mean food wise we are arepedos to the core we mm, arepas that's for right that's breakfast right. lunch and dinner <laughs> every day <laughs> arepas yeah. all day for me musica llanera de venezuela so like simon diaz harp oh, maracas uh, drum for me, circles i'm from puerto rico so we have el gran combo uh -huh. salsa yeah, and oh uh, yeah and what are you working on like what's next uh, we shot a short film in medellin colombia colombian Venezuelan mix. Uh, we shot a documentary in Medellin. Uh, it's called Buscando America. It's on YouTube. It's about oh. our story in Medellin. So go check that All out. All right, we're gonna check it out. Thanks, man. Oh, yeah. All right, guys, that was absolutely inspiring. Thank you to everyone who participated. I'll see you guys next time. Hasta la vuelta. <laughs>